Hello Aquarius, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your messages from Spirit Reading. It will be for May 2021 for the sign of Aquarius. And remember, these readings can just be messages. So let's see what we have and pull some Oracle cards and then we'll go into the Tarot cards. So what do we have for Aquarius, please? Angels, Spirits, Guides. I've pre-shuffled all the decks. So I'm going to choose the first card. What do we have for Aquarius, please? Angels, Spirits, Guides. Message for our lovely Aquarius. Thank you. Okay. Two cards there. Engage higher reason. And we have accept disappointments gracefully. Message for Aquarius, please. Angels, spirits, guides. Message for our lovely Aquarians. Thank you. What is the message from spirit for Aquarius? Thank you. We have choices. When you accept responsibility for your life and the choices that you make, you begin to tap into the power of your own spirit. You'll be able to listen to and appreciate the intuitive wisdom that's inside you and apply it positively and constructively to your outside world. Okay. Message for Aquarius, please. Angels, spirits, guides. What is the message Aquarius needs to hear for May 2021? Message Aquarius needs to hear for May 2021, please. Thank you. Yeah. We have number one, align your universe. This is aligning with where you want to be. Could be with some choices here. Engaging higher reason. Could be with some disappointment here, Aquarius. But this is about navigating out distractions. Yeah. Okay. And final message for Aquarius final message for Aquarius thank you before we get into the cards thank you so we have monkey experience all that life has to offer Archangel Raphael this is just embracing it all um, feels very lovely very lovely okay so I'm going to pull three cards, Aquarius. First card being your message from Spirit. So what do we have for Aquarius, please? Angels, Spirit's Guides, message for our lovely Aquarians. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, strength. Five of Swords. Yeah. And we have the Three of Wands. Yeah. I, I get it. I get it. You know, the strength card is spirit is acknowledging that there is a reason to keep your head. You know, this is a card of when you are in your strength, when you are in your power, your inner power, there is nothing that you can't overcome. This is about having the courage, the strength to deal with any fear or challenge or adversity that's coming your way. So there's definitely an energy of facing fears, facing adversities head on, because when you do, you have the power to overcome them. Um, and bring positive change. It's innate, which is a card of mastery and change. So it feels very lovely here. And the message from spirit is be strong. Be strong in your thought. Be strong in your approach as much as be strong in that inner strength. Some of you may have had some disappointment. I mean, this, this can be a card of winners and losers. And it can be a card of bad feeling, resentment. Um, it can be a card of conflict as well here. And this is why you need to keep your head here. It's interesting because Venus in, a, in Aquarius, which is this card, this is your energy, is asking you in this respect to see past the now. Don't let this distract you. This is about keeping your head. 
Um, it is about mastering your thoughts. It is about focusing on the things that are really important and not allowing any lower negative base energies to distract you this month. Because you can see this person is looking back, you know, at those that he has conquered. It, it feels in this situation, there's a feeling of kind of winners and losers here, Aquarius. But you're being told, don't, don't even worry about that. Don't worry about that. Because there is more important things to worry about here. You need to align and make the right choices for you now. And see past the now. See past whatever this disruptive, negative energy that can bring negative conflict, negative th thinking and so on to your door. So there's definitely an energy of see past that. Because when you do... There's something better. Your ships are coming in. This is the first signs of success. What you have been taking steps to, what have you, what you've been manifesting. When you focus on what you want to go for and see past the now of what this conflict is all about, there are greater things coming your way. There are better things to take action towards. And this is about things opening up for you. The first signs of success coming your way. Your ships are coming in. Um, expansion progress uh and, and like i said there's the first signs of success coming so there's definitely an energy if you know this it's not worth your time or energy so don't focus on it engage that higher reason logic and it's almost kind of like an energy of of see beyond whatever this is when you do you'll see there's something better for you and there's definitely an energy of greater success this is the first signs of success coming your way it, it feels really beautiful, Aquarius, I have to say. It feels really beautiful. This is just put things down to life experience and just embrace it all because all of it is a learning curve. And you have the power, you have the power to influence the first signs of success coming your way by the actions that you take, by mastering those negative thoughts, negative influences and distractions that will block your path if you're not careful. So there's definitely an energy of there are greater things coming your way, better things, uh, get perspective, see past whatever this is and move forward. Um, take action in the right direction because this is about great things are opening up for you when you do. Uh, lovely, lovely energy. So I'm gonna pull a final message. Final message for Aquarius, please. Thank you. Nice energy. We've got number 22. Take the time to pamper yourself or let others take care of you. That's very nice energy. I'm going to pull you one more, Aquarius. It's also surround yourself by positive energies, positive people. That flew out. Yeah, I love that energy. So we've got number 12. We understand that you sometimes may feel alone, but we are always here. Love it. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful month for you, Aquarius, and I will see you next time. Thank you.